is a quick little video on making your own carbon transfer paper and how to use it. So start with a nice quality paper because you're going to use this tool over and over and heavier paper like this nice drawing paper will hold up. You don't want it to be any thicker than that because you're going to be counting on it to be soft and you want to take a bold uh, pencil and using the side of it cover the whole thing. You can see how I've done that here, right? Okay. Um, so we then apply that to this project, which is printed off of Pinterest. Okay, and I had the kids do the background. And while the background was drying, sketch out their truck. And everybody did whatever their truck was. So that's my little truck right there. And I stayed pretty much in tune with the whole style of that truck, uh, for clarity's sake. So you can erase and you know draw on that as long as you want. You get it just the way you want, or you can do this with a photograph uh, image uh, from a copy machine, right? And what you do is you get out the paper or um, canvas that you're going to paint on. You decide where on that canvas you want to have this thing that you have done. Maybe I wanted it a little bit higher there. And then you tape it around the side. And that makes a little door. And you put your carbon paper face down. Oh, you can see I've used this before. Put your carbon paper face down, close the door, and uh, a ballpoint pencil is a uh, ballpoint pen is really good to transfer that with. You press down pretty hard. You can look uh, and check and see if you're getting the um, enough of an image. It's different on the canvas than it is, of course, on uh, paper and a nice hard surface. Uh, but yeah, it's a great way to transfer, and you can do it with photos. And then you can spend your time um, working on your finished product instead of uh, trying to get over that hurdle. Yeah, when you're done, um, I recommend repairing it, putting the black uh, back over it, and then stashing it. So it'll be ready for you next time. Okay, let me know how that goes.